welcome back to Emmy's Kitchen. In today's video, we'll be doing some green seasoning. This is another must-have recipe. Um, you can use green seasoning with your fish, your chicken, any meat of your choice. But I usually use it for my fish and my chicken. I want to use this opportunity to thank you all my returning sus subscribers. And if you're here for the first time, please click the subscription button and do not forget to turn on the notification bell so that you get alert when I post new video. Stay tuned and enjoy this video. So we're going to go over our ingredients. These are celery, our green onion, leeks, some white pepper, jansa, uh, we call this bebe. And um, some ginger, our garlic, our onion. This is parsley. I have I have asked this in my backyard and um, the basil. I also have asked the basil in my backyard. So this is another easy recipe. All I'll be doing right now is put all of this into my blender and blend it. So I'll start with my green onion. Just cutting them in chunks. Go with the legs now. So when washing your legs, make sure you open this part and um, wash it properly because it always has some sun in. It always has sun in here. So just be careful when washing it. I'm not going to use all of this because it's too big. So I'll go in with our celery now. So if you want a very smooth consistency, you can avoid the celery or use very little because celery is very fibrous. It has all these strings, whatever it's called. So it's very hard to blend. So um, go in with our onion. My blender is full already. I'm just going to put in some water and blend this. So my blender is full. I'm going to go ahead and blend this. batch is ready. I'm just going to dump it into the pan. And I will continue with the rest of the ingredients. So for the quantity of spice I'm making this ginger is not enough but this is all I have at home I have powdered ginger so I'm gonna throw a little bit in to compensate for this there's my garlic going in my white pepper that and jansa the basil And I'll put in some water. I'm gonna 
dump in my parsley. This is freshly harvested. The smell is just out of this world. And it's organic too. is ready everything is well blended uh -oh. forgot I have this in so this is our spice our ingredients well blended I'm going in with our maggi now Our salt and uh, our oil. You can go with whichever oil you want. I'm using canola. You can use olive oil. Okay, these are all my ingredients put together, and I'll let it boil until the water is all gone. If you want to know it's ready, you seal the oil settling on the top. I'll show you guys at the end how it looks. Stay tuned. This has been boiling for over 40 minutes and it's all ready. You can see the oil is now at the top. That's how you know it's ready. Look at this. Oh my goodness. This is how our green seasoning is looking at the end oh my goodness the flavor is out of this world and the taste is everything i'll be using this to season my fish like i said before you can use it with any meat of your choice but usually i'll use it for my chicken and my fish i've not tried it with pork or any other meat not with beef though beef is a little complicated when it comes to seasoning so this is it the taste is great thank you for watching this video till this point if you haven't done so yet please give me a thumbs up share this video and subscribe to my channel emits kitchen thank you bye bye